What's up guys, this is Brian J's Nerd Talk and this is my short review of Long Chills and Queso by Brandon Sanderson. And it was a really good book. It's a science fiction novella that's made uh, in the spirit of Philip K. Dick and uh, Do Androids Dream of Electric Sheep? And it's not as good as Do Androids Dream of Electric Sheep, but it's still a really good book. It's very entertaining. The main character is like completely misogynistic and he's like straight out like a 1920s and 1950s uh, character personality of like Humphrey Bogart from 1950s film noir and that's what it is it's it's film noir or neo film noir in a science fiction setting um, this detective case where he's investigating he has different twists and turns but it all makes sense in the end he figures it out and he end like a lot of classic film noirs the, the main bad guy is a woman and uh, dames are nothing but trouble just like in a classic 1950s film noir uh, and it was really good. I, I mean, the way Brandon Sanderson, because he's nothing like this in real life, but the way he writes this character, uh, his personality, and just the themes of this story in the book, it's like very different from everything that he writes. And it's like the opposite of who he is, but uh, it's really good. I, I would give it an eight out of 10. An eight out of 10, really good, very entertaining. It's an easy read. And I was able to read it um, in a couple hours. It's just 34 pages long. It's not that long. And it was easy to read. I liked it. It was very interesting. There was also some science fiction technology stuff that was really cool with the guns and the weapons and uh, the DNA scanning and brain scans and stuff like that. So that was really cool. I liked it. So this is Brian J's Nerd Talk and this is my short review of Brandon Sanderson's Long Chills and Queso. I give it an 8 out of 10 and on Goodreads I give it 4 stars out of 5 stars. So this is Brian J's Nerd Talk and I'll talk to y'all later. Hit the like and subscribe. Peace.